Hello, welcome to Waypoint Survival. Today, let's make an improvised water filter. To make this water filter, first of all you need some kind of a plastic bottle. This is a two liter bottle. You can find these unfortunately in a lot of places around the world. Uh, no matter where you are, plastic and plastic bottles, of course they float. And so around creeks, streams, rivers, any place like that, you'll be able to find a plastic bottle. So you, it doesn't have to be a two liter, one liter, half liter. Of course, that will limit the amount of uh, water you're able to filter. So we'll lay that down. Next thing you need is some charcoal from, your, uh, from a fire. Set that down. And then you will need some gravel and you will need some sand. You can find most of this where you are as far as the uh, terrain is concerned around obviously lakes, rivers, creeks, streams. You can find most of this stuff and of course the charcoal you get from then the Then you're fire. going to need a handkerchief and some sort of a container to catch your cleaned water in. And this is just homemade billy can and so I will show you how to put it all together. Stay tuned. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is you need to cut the bottom off of the bottle because we're going to use this end for a funnel. So pocket knife and we're just going to cut this end off. Of course be careful you don't cut yourself. And of course you could use the bottom for your catch container if you wish. have to be really precise. Cut that off. Alright, there we go. So that's the first step. Then, you want to take your knife and you want to drill a hole into the end of the container. Alright, so we have put a hole in our container lid here and we've got our two liter bottle so we're going to screw this back on. And now, what we're going to do is we're going to take, first of all, our rag. Uh, you can use anything, actually. This is 100% cotton bandana. And I will warn you, if you buy this new, uh, I had to wash this three times to get all the red excess dye out of it and to make it more supple. When you buy these new at the store, they they're, they got so much uh, stuff in it from the factory, the dyes and all of that, that they really don't filter well. And you don't have to be really neat about this. Uh, just kind of stuff it in here and it's our it's our first layer uh, and, and and it's also a, from this end our final layer so we just kind of put that in there loosely and then the next thing we want to do is we want to take our charcoal and we're going to put a layer of charcoal this is the most important step and of course after a fire charcoal is uh, that which was not completely burned up and it's uh, very small it pours and filters a lot of things a lot of people know about charcoal so I'm going to pour some charcoal in here, make us a good layer. And like I said, this is the most important stage. So we want to get good charcoal in there. And of course, all this will compress. So there you see we've got our, our first two layers completed. And then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to take some sand. And you just get any sand anywhere. Uh, try to make sure it's relatively clean, of course. And we're going to pour a layer of sand in here. Okay. There we go. Alright, the next thing that we're going to do then is we're going to pour our gravel on top. Like this. So there you have a basic filter. We've got gravel, sand, charcoal, and then our final stage is our handkerchief. So here we have our improvised water filter and just melted a couple holes in here with, uh, I carry in my kit, some nails, with some wire wrapped around it. So I just heated up a nail and melted some holes in here. A little bit of paracord and now we are able to hang our water filter. 
Now all we need to do is make a tripod. So now we've put up our tripod, which is simply three poles. These about eight feet long. And uh, we lashed them together with a simple tripod lashing here. And then we have our filter. And what we're going to do is we're just going to take this and we're going to hang it. Just like so. Over top of one of the poles. It hangs right there. Now, we've got to put water in it. We're going to gather, gather some from the creek here. So here we have our filter and our billy can with our clean water, or cleaned water I should say. Now remember, you'll still want to boil this, but what this does is it gets all the debris and everything out of it and filter through the charcoal. It does somewhat clean it. And so this is the tripod arrangement. Back off here and give you a little better view of it. And that's how you make an improvised water filter from a two liter bottle. Another important thing, when you fill it up, make sure you don't go above your holes here. Keep your water level below these holes. Otherwise, dirty water will run out and around and drip down into your water source. So there we could take that billy can and put it over a fire and boil it. And we have cleaned. And then once it will be boiled, then it will be purified. This is James Bender for Waypoint Survival. Thanks for watching. Please share, subscribe, like it, and we'll talk to you next time.